Yo, what is up guys, it's your boy Nox or Grant here back with another video for you guys today playing another 1v1 ranked duel as Hades up against Changa, a god we just played in a recent video, so we'll see how we do against her. Let's go. Alright, here we go. Uh, I'm gonna go the typical start I've been going with. A lot of mages, which is Bancross, because life's still super good right now. We're playing the Chonga, so... Probably... Maybe want, like, a Bracer, even though I'm Hades. I feel like a Bracer would be kind of good, but he'll probably get anti-heal, so... Maybe... Just a shell? Yeah, we're just gonna go a shell, and then one of each potion i think we're yeah we'll just go one of each i was thinking maybe go a multi potion but we're good we are good ready to go Chonga's pretty good in duel but i feel like hades will definitely deal more damage it's just whether or not the Chonga is going to be able to like out heal us basically i mean that's going to be okay he's already getting but well, he's not going for the okay just got the small ones thought maybe he's going to do the like the whole buff Yeah, but the thing will be is the Chonga is going to be able to, like, out lifesteal us, basically, because we're both going to build lifesteal, both going to build uh, anti-heal, so. We'll see how it goes. He does have a little bit of a lead because, uh, oh, he actually went Mage's Blessing. I thought maybe you would go Bancroft against me, but he went Mage's Blessing and then two, um, two Chalices, so he'll probably be able to get the red. Um, just because he'll be able to sustain longer, but we'll see. Okay, he's doing a good amount of damage to me, not gonna lie. Good thing we didn't go the, the multi-potion, otherwise we'd... ...not have this one for health. Okay, he's gonna... Oh, he actually sundered. Okay. He sundered me. And he killed me because of it. Oh, did he? Wait. Wait, how much is... Wait, 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 wait. Let me add this up. Wait, 700 plus 512? No, he, he... Okay, so... Yeah, he didn't buy upgraded Sunder. You wouldn't have enough gold to get the chalices and upgraded Sunder. So he just hit me with regular Sunder and then killed me. Like, what a play. And then he got red. I'm not gonna even check. I guarantee he got it. So we're just going to get our blue now. Wow, he just sundered me. And I didn't think he was going to get his one up quick enough to be able to kill me, but he obviously did. So that was a good play by him. I'll give it to him. But we're actually only down like 400 gold and we're pretty even on levels. So don't really think that was a big deal. Not a big deal at all. He's probably doing his blue now. Wait, why did he just go over there? What is he doing? Did he just now do red? Like, am I lost? I don't know why he came from there. Alright, we'll go ahead and get our two now. I'm a little scared of him, not gonna lie. Alright, we're gonna use this. He's just gonna tank it, because he does have... Because he has Sunder, he can't really... I should have used Shell in the last fight, I just realized that. I think we can kill him right here. He'll heal up, but not like a ton. Okay, I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have done that. Ugh. Do still have shell. Should have used it in the last fight, but we'll probably use it this one. Okay, we're out of here. Um, yeah. We both don't have, uh... Boots, but he still was able to catch up to me just because I didn't really dash that far away from him or dive, whatever, whatever you want to call it. So he's starting Book of Thoth and he's not getting boots second. So, well, I guess first if you don't count Mage's Blessing, but he's playing this really well. I, I'm just not expecting him to do as much damage as he is, like, just to be honest. Like, I don't know. He's doing a ton of damage. He's doing his blue right now. I can hear him. All 
Oh, he didn't back, okay. So he's a level up, he's um, about 800 gold up. And he's playing this really well. But I think I think we can come back. I think Hades maybe does have the advantage, not really sure. I feel like these are pretty similar gods. Okay, so he is trying to immune that, but... Wait, did he just ult? Is that what he just did? Okay. All right, so we're gonna heal up off this wave, maybe ult him because like you said, he does have Sunder. Okay, now he did. This should be a kill. Oh, he mooned out of it. Ugh. He tried to Sunder me. Oh no, I'm dead. No, I'm not. <laughs> Okay, we can kill him right here if we play it right. Actually, we're just gonna heal off the wave. Play it smart. Okay, I didn't get the back minions. Alright, we're good. We're good. I'm nervous right now. I'm nervous. Okay, he didn't hit me with that. He's taking some archer damage. Red just spawned. I wonder if I could stay... I'm pretty sure I can. Okay, he is Book of Thought, so he's stacking. He's definitely ahead on items right now. Okay, he's actually gonna back, so that means we can get red. All right, we're going to clear this, and then yeah, we get red. Nice, 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 nice. Should be able to get red. I actually didn't hit this with my dash. Wasn't smart. Come on, come on, dude! I can't lose this. All right, we are all good. We're out of here. Oh, don't come around. The oh, okay, here we go. Just gonna stop my back. I can just feel it. Uh, I guess we'll just stay for this wave. I guess he's gonna try to do my blue. I need mana. Give me mana. Come on, bro. There we go. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to stop him from doing that. We're gonna back. Hopefully he doesn't come around this corner. Don't hit me, dude. <laughs> he missed. <laughs> he really did try to stop me. Should I go cool the uh... Should I go cooldown? I feel like I should to keep up with her cooldown. And then we're gonna go... Yeah, because we have to go Pestilence, so we, we're we not gonna have a lot of cooldown. Like, unless we get cooldown boots. You know, if we got pin boots, then we wouldn't have any cooldown unless we, you know, maybe got, like, Chronos pinned or something. So I might end up doing, actually. But, uh, yeah. We're gonna have to go Pestilence, Divine Ruin to handle her healing. And then, not sure what else we're gonna get. Maybe go into more lifesteal. Okay, she doesn't really do a lot of damage to me right now. And we do a good amount. Ooh, are we gonna, we can't kill her right here. But yeah, she definitely doesn't do a lot of damage to us right now. I feel like the cooldown boots are helping to get our abilities up a little bit quicker. Did she do her blue? I'm not sure. Obviously she did mine, but... Probably should have just went for it and checked. Okay, it is here. I don't know if we can do it in time. I don't think we can. And we're actually able to get it, which is really nice. Okay, and she's just gonna follow me now all the way back to- Okay, she sundered me and then she... She's just gonna keep following me. Tried to hit me through the wall. I'm not actually sure if that can even go through the wall. Does she upgrade sunder? Uh, no, I don't think so. Like, I don't know why she's trying to like- Like, if you upgrade sunder, it's smart to do it at the beginning of the fight because it makes them- lose some protections for the next five seconds, but like just straight up sundering me isn't gonna do much. And she missed her ultimate, which is really good too. Another thing that's annoying is the chalices, so like... The chalices help her stay in lane so long. Okay, that was a nice immune on her part. That was nice. Yeah, I feel like we're gonna have to go Chronos pinned it just because her abilities just come up so much quicker than mine. All right, we're gonna back off here and play it safe. Red is up though. Dude, I actually wanna fight her. Oh. Do I wanna shell? Do I wanna shell? Nope, not gonna shell. 
decide to save the shell. If we can heal up here, I'm just worried about her hitting me with an ability ring. Nice. We were able to pull her in range of the tower and get our combo off on her. That was really nice. And we're able to get red. That was actually a really big kill. Like, that was able... That let me to... Okay, that allowed me to fully come back. Like, we're, we'll be pretty much even. And we get some tower damage. She's going to lose some XP from uh, the tower killing the minions. And we're able to get red. This is really good for us. Really good. And then we are able to get Pestilence now. And then, do I want to go straight into a Divine Ruin? I think so. I think that's what we're going to next here. And this will really stop uh, or really help with her healing. Do I want to go? I think we'll just go Aegis. So when she ults us or uses her combo, hopefully we can stop that. Your middle tower has been destroyed. I think, yeah, we're still down actually. Okay, she's just hiding around the corner. I was gonna check if she had done this. So we don't do a lot of damage to each other. It's just gonna be a lot of poking each other down. Going ultra here. She's just tanking it. I don't know what, what she's doing. She didn't immune that. She would 100% been dead. I thought she would have died anyway, though, to be honest. I'm surprised she lived right there. That's what's uh, causing her to, you know, like, lose fights. Is she's trying to pressure me so hard that she gets, you know, just too aggressive. So we're just going to try to pressure back, hopefully get this tower down soon. Wait, oh, she did her blue. I don't know why I was so confused. Okay, so she's backing right there, and that's actually going to allow us to get her... Get a tower, I think. Which will be really nice. Give us some extra gold. That'll help even up the lead. Because she is ahead. Let's see how close we'll be to uh, her. So now we're only about 300 gold down, which isn't a lot. Right now we both we both don't have pen, and we have a lot of healing, so we don't do a lot of damage to each other. Like, we just have to hit each other so many times before it really does too much. Alright, nice. And we're actually going to alter here. And this might be a kill. Okay, so she immuned out of it. Gonna shell here, and that is a kill. Nicely done. She gets her abilities off way quicker, but we seem to do a good chunk of damage. And the thing that really killed her is she stood in um, her minion wave when I used my combo on her, which does extra damage. So uh, that really got her low health wise because she stood there and it just did way more damage than it usually would have done. So we'll go Divine Ruin. Not sure what I want to go into next. I feel like maybe go into Obsidian Shard after that. And then last item might be more Lifesteal. Not really sure yet. If she, well, she's going to go Divine Ruin too, so we probably won't go double Lifesteal. I feel like it won't be that helpful because of that. If we can just make sure to get away from her so our items aren't affecting us and then we can just heal up and then go back in and fight that might be the play okay our ultimate's coming back up soon her ultimate's 100 up she might sunder us again who knows okay she's separating the minions which is annoying okay she immuned out just gonna sunder so i can feel it We have Aegis up, don't have Shell up, we have to keep... Nice, we're able to block some of the damage, she's sundered. Okay, we, we should be able to kill her here, I think, as long as... Play it smart. 
come on. Oh, she's so low. Come on. Oh, she blinked. She bought blink. What? Bought blink. What a maniac. All right, so actually she gonna go right here, take her blue, get something off the fact that we're able to out trade her right there. And then we'll just go ahead and pick it up and back, and uh, we'll wait for Obsidian Shard. We're really close to being able to get it. Yeah, so we definitely out trade her right now. She actually bought Spear instead of Divine Rune, so that makes me want to probably buy double life steal because pestilence isn't really gonna stop double life steal a ton so yeah and especially if we just back away from her and like let the pestilence not affect us and then heal up and like i said go back in i feel like we'll be fine and even when we are like near her i don't think pestilence is really gonna do it like a lot against double life steal what is she doing we're actually gonna alter here I'm gonna try to do it as often as possible. Might be able to, should be able to kill her here actually. She doesn't ever blink up and yeah, she can't get away. She cannot get away from me. That's probably the biggest advantage I have is she can't really run away well. Like all she has is the blink. She probably should have bought like a sprint. The Sunder did work out for her early game but it's really not helping her much late game. This might be Phoenix, not really sure. We're gonna get a few hits off, wait for our minions are on the way. Yeah, this isn't gonna be Phoenix. Our minions are just gonna be a little bit too late. If we had an extra maybe like two or three seconds that she was dead, we might be able to get it, but. Okay, she blinked on us. What a maniac. Red is up. I probably should have just gone back and gotten red. Okay, I missed that, so I'm gonna back off. I'm gonna alter here. And that is another kill. So I'm starting to figure out that she can immune out of my ultimate, but if I get close enough to her, she immunes and it doesn't fully get her out of it. So I just have to get really close to her and she has to be right next to me when she ults or when I ult and then I can kill her like every time. That combo definitely does enough damage to her and this will give us Phoenix, which is super nice. And then we can go get red on the way back. And then we will get, uh, forget what it's called, Typhoon's thing? Typhoon's, I don't really know. We'll go ahead and get that. And that'll help a lot with our lifesteal and damage, obviously. And now we have red too. We haven't had red most, oh, okay. Okay, dude, yeah, just follow me around. Like, like stop. Like, let me back. Like, he was really gonna be annoying right there. Alright, then we're gonna go and buy some wards, because Chonga isn't really good at doing bull demon. I mean, she can, but it takes a while, so I'm not super worried about it, but... we we'll go ahead and put wards out just so we know where she's at at all times and all that stuff. Go ahead and clear this. Go ahead and put our wards down. Put one right here. Pull one right here, and then we'll just push the wave up. Hades is good at ending the game. He can just ult the Titan and uh, works pretty well. So we might look to do that, poke it down a little bit. And if we can get it maybe like 4K health, we'll try to end the game. The Changa shouldn't have, it's not great at clearing fire minions, but it's not terrible at it either. So Alright, so we have a wave and a half, so we're gonna try to go in right here. Oh, we might die here. Is she gonna... Is that gonna be game? Oh, I kind of want to go back in. Kind of want to go back in and end it, but we're just gonna go back 
go ahead and get a, a power potion and go back in. Play it smart, go back in with full health, and we'll get a, a health chalice to help a little bit. So this should be game, there should be no way uh, she stops us. Even though we want fire minions, we can just dive in and use our combo, and this, should, this game should end at about 20 minutes. Should be good to go. And have another W. Four to two kill wise. Like I said, she definitely won the early game, but the later the game got, the easier it became for me. Okay, so she's trying to pressure me because she knows, like, she knows I can just end the game. Okay, so she's sundering me. I'm gonna go ahead and do this so the sunder wears off, and we're just gonna go in real quick. I'm just gonna ignore you. Uh, and that is game. Nothing she could really do there, it kind of sucks for her, but I did win the late game and did pretty well. So, anyways guys, thanks so much for watching. As always, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next video.